Neon Genesis Evangelion aired in Japan in 1995 and quickly became one of the most popular and influential anime of the 1990s. According to a 2021 interview with 4Gamer, Takanobu Terada, the then Super Robot Wars series producer, shared that while Evangelion was airing on TV, they could not include it in SRW. This was due to SEGA being one of the main sponsors for Evangelion while it was airing on TV, as well as being the copyright holder for making Evangelion video games. Furthermore, there wasn't a single SRW game on SEGA hardware up to this point in time. However, Terada was told by the higher-ups that things might change if they made a SRW game for the Sega Saturn. This led to the development of Super Robot Wars F for the Sega Saturn, with Evangelion chosen to be one of the new debuting series. It was good timing, as Evangelion had finished airing by 1996, and Sega's embargo on the series for video games was slowly being lifted. Super Robot Wars F was released for the Sega Saturn in 1997 and eventually ported to the PlayStation in 1998. Evangelion creator Hideaki Anno was a fan of the Super Robot Wars series and mecha anime in general. In the 2005 book, Gainax Interviews, Anno revealed how eagerly he wanted Evangelion to appear in SRW. He made sure Studio Gainax allowed the series to debut in SRW F. For Evangelion's debut in SRWF, Anno contributed some ideas. These ideas included Bright Noah slapping Shinji, Eva's being able to fly, and powerful attacks being able to break an AT field. Anno also wanted Quattro Bajina, aka Shah Asnobo, to pilot an Eva unit too. Unfortunately, that last idea could not be fulfilled due to copyright reasons. In addition, Anno even provided illustrations featuring the Gundam, Mazinga Z, and Getter Robo. Anno's illustrations would be used as motifs for a booklet that was the pre-order bonus for the Sega Saturn version of Super Robot Wars F. Anno showed care when drawing Mazinga Z and Getter 1, using their manga designs as inspiration. When making his rebuild of Evangelion movies, Anno would tap on some of the ideas that were utilized during Evangelion's appearance in various SRW games, allowing things to come full circle. Arno's later involvement as the director of Shin Godzilla would eventually lead to a series of collaboration projects between Evangelion and Godzilla. One notable project was the two series having a crossover event in Super Robot Wars Cross Omega in 2016. Overall, while there were some initial problems, Evangelion eventually managed to debut in SRW thanks to the developers making a SRW game on Sega hardware, as well as Anno's passion for Mecha and the Super Robot Wars series, thus leading to many more future Evangelion appearances in the franchise. <laughs>